Ever wondered what I eat in a day to start losing weight as a stay-at-home mom? Well, let's dive in and kickstart our day. The morning is a special time. It's like a blank canvas, waiting to be painted with choices that will set the tone for the rest of the day. And the first brush stroke, that's your morning beverage. For me, it's a cup of coffee, but not just any coffee. This is coffee with sweetener, not sugar. Now, you might be thinking, why sweetener? Well, it's simple. Sweeteners can provide the taste without the calories. Plus, the caffeine in coffee is a natural stimulant that can increase your metabolism and promote weight loss. It's like a gentle nudge to your body saying, hey, it's time to get moving. But the coffee is just the beginning. If we want to paint a masterpiece of a day, we need more than just caffeine. That's where the half hour morning workout comes in. Now, I know what you're thinking. A workout in the morning. And I get it, the bed is warm and the day is cold. But trust me, a 30 minute workout in the morning is a game changer. Think of it like this. When you exercise, you're burning calories, right? But here's the kicker. When you work out in the morning, you're not just burning calories during the workout. You're setting your body up to burn more calories throughout the day. It's like lighting a fire first thing in the morning and letting it burn all day long. Plus, there's something empowering about starting your day with a workout. It sends a message to yourself that you're in control, that you're taking charge of your health and your day. So that's the morning kickoff. A cup of coffee with sweetener to wake up your metabolism and a half hour workout to light the fire of calorie burning. It's not just about losing weight. It's about setting a healthy tone for your day and by extension your life. That's how you kickstart your day on a high note, with a cup of coffee and some exercise. After the initial morning kick, hydration is next on the list. Now we all know the importance of water, but did you know that drinking 2 liters of water throughout the day not only keeps you hydrated, but it also boosts your metabolism? That's right, staying hydrated can actually help you burn calories more efficiently. Moving on to breakfast, we have a nutritious bowl of overnight oatmeal waiting for us. This isn't just any breakfast, it's a breakfast that keeps you feeling full longer. How you ask? Well, oatmeal is packed with fiber and protein, two elements that contribute significantly to feelings of fullness. Fiber slows down digestion, keeping you feeling satiated for longer periods of time, while protein reduces levels of ghrelin, a hormone that stimulates hunger. So, starting your day with a bowl of oatmeal can help you control those mid-morning snack cravings, which is a big win for weight loss. That's your morning sorted, hydration and a filling breakfast. Moving on to lunch, we keep it light and fresh. Let's talk about the magic of incorporating fruits into this meal. Fruits are nature's candy, packed with a wealth of nutrients, low in calories and high in fiber. This combination is a winning ticket to feeling satisfied without overeating. Take the humble apple for instance, it's high in fiber and water, two qualities that make it filling and perfect for weight loss. Or consider a banana rich in potassium and helps curb your sweet cravings. Pineapples are not just tropical delights, they're also packed with vitamin C and bromelain, which aids digestion. And then there are pears, wonderful sources of fiber that help keep your digestive system on track. These fruits are not just delicious, but also contribute to a balanced diet, helping you maintain your weight or even shed those extra pounds. And the best part? You can mix and match them to your heart's content. That's lunch for you, light, fresh and full of fiber. As the day winds down, it's time for a protein-packed dinner. This is the meal where we really get to reward our bodies for the hard work they've put in throughout the day. Now let's talk about the protein component of our dinner. You can choose from chicken, shrimp or minced beef. The choice is yours, but the goal remains the same. To provide your body with the protein it requires for muscle recovery and growth. You see, protein is an essential building block for our bodies. It helps repair the muscle tissues that were broken down during your morning workout and fosters healthy growth of new muscle tissue. So whether you've been lifting weights, doing yoga or chasing after your kids, your muscles are going to thank you for this protein boost. But we're not stopping at protein. To complement the protein source, we're also incorporating sweet potatoes and a variety of veggies into our dinner. Sweet potatoes are a fantastic source of complex carbohydrates. These carbs are digested slowly by our bodies, providing a steady release of energy rather than a sudden spike and crash. Plus, they're packed with fiber, which aids in digestion and keeps you feeling satisfied longer. And then there are the veggies. Vibrant, fresh and full of essential nutrients, they play a crucial role in maintaining a balanced diet. 
They provide an array of vitamins and minerals like vitamin C, potassium, and folic acid, just to name a few. Not to mention, they add a pop of color and a crunch that can make any dinner plate more appealing. So, here's what a protein-packed dinner might look like. A piece of grilled chicken, a side of roasted sweet potatoes, and a colorful medley of steamed veggies. Delicious, nutritious, and perfectly satisfying after a day of being active and eating well. And that's your dinner. Rich in protein and balanced with veggies. Now here comes the golden rule of our daily diet. Avoid eating after 7 p.m. You might wonder, why so specific? It's simple. By setting a cutoff time for eating, we allow our body to properly digest our food before we hit the sack. This doesn't just lead to better digestion, but also aids in improving the quality of our sleep. Now, let's consider another significant aspect. Weight loss. Late night snacking and overeating are often the culprits behind those stubborn pounds. By implementing the 7 p.m. rule, we're effectively putting a stop to these unhealthy habits. It's like setting a boundary that reminds us, hey, it's time to give your body a break. Remember, the goal here isn't to starve ourselves, but to create a routine that promotes healthier eating habits. So as the clock strikes seven, let's switch to hydration and give our body the rest it deserves. That's the key to our daily diet, a balanced intake, hydration, and the golden 7 p.m. rule.